Local police here in the valley are aware of the continuing developments of that case in Piketon, especially since there may be a drug connection. First News reporter Jay Ricciuti has been talking with local police about the drug problem locally. He joins us now in the studio with more. Hi, Lauren. Members of the Mahoning Valley Drug Task Force admit while the focus in this area is often on drugs like heroin or methamphetamine, marijuana is and has been very prevalent around the valley. As we've been telling you, investigators in Pike County found sophisticated growing operations at three of the four crime scenes they discovered last Friday. In this area, the last significant raid on a marijuana operation drug task force agents staged was in the summer of 2014 when they searched a property on Western Reserve Road in Canfield Township and seized close to 500 plants. But even on a smaller scale, police say finding pot at local heroin or meth raids is usually the rule instead of the exception. One agent says he can't remember the last time the task force served a search warrant on a drug house and didn't find marijuana along with other drugs. Coming up tonight, we'll hear from those agents with some pretty surprising answers about where the dope in this area originates. And we'll also hear from the Ohio Attorney General, who you just saw in that package from CBS, who's in the Valley speaking tonight in Boardman. I'll be asking him about the investigation in Pike County, as well as the statewide drug problem. Lauren?